about this one? Playing catch is kind of like hitting off the tee. A lot of people just kind of go through the motions and don't really understand that it's, it's one of the most important parts of your day. Because all of baseball, all of playing defense can be boiled down to just playing catch. As an infielder, the biggest thing for me, after my arm's loose, you know, you, you throw 10, 15 throws, nice and easy, get your arm going. The biggest thing for me though is moving my feet. Playing shortstop, third, second, uh, even outfield I play. Uh, no matter where I'm playing, I have to generate momentum with my feet. My feet save my arm, my feet generate more power in my throws. So every time I'm throwing uh, in catch, I'm shuffling toward my target and I'm trying to drive it through his chest. When we play catch, we make sure to get the right grip on the baseball, point our shoulder, nice overhand throw. We're gonna try to hit each other in the right in the chest with every, with every throw front side I want to make sure I'm always pointed at Nate with my front shoulder where, where, wherever my front shoulder is that's where my ball's gonna go okay always remember that now the difference between someone like Nate and I I get loose throwing over the top you know if I'm playing outfield that works uh, first base like Nate you know he, he generally always throws over the top as an infielder I don't always have the luxury of throwing over the top turning two, I throw sidearm um, sometimes if I catch one in the six hole, I have to throw sidearm again just to get rid of it. So what I do, once I start getting loose, I start mixing up my arm angles. Right at his chest. Uh, three quarters. Um, sidearm, only a couple because it's not necessary too often in the game. No matter the case, I'm still shuffling my feet and I'm still trying to drive it through his chest. 